Welcome to another episode of We're going to do homemade pizza pie Made a dough with flour, yeast and olive oil After which we place the dough in a bowl to prove And we've also got some pastry Dough balls, 2 times 2 equals 4 In a pan, tin cherry tomatoes because they're sweet and awesome Oregano, garlic, salt, heat, blend Tomato sauce, done to keep the blood pressure up, we've melted some butter, put it through some chopped garlic, chopped parsley, winner, winner. Righto, pizza toppings, mozzarella, fresh torn basil, uh, we've got some olives that are in that bowl. We've also got cured meats, ones which got fennel seeds in, and one which is posh and hammy. Here's two pans being best buds, and now we build the pizza. Um, I did raw dough in each of them, and I thought I'd cook it in the pastry so we've started with tomato mozzie basil like a classic vibe then i thought we'd go with garlic bread a rustic meat feast follows with olives and then we finish with another garlic bread and anything left over you know i'm not going to leave it to waste so we put it on top uh, finished it all with that some glorious tomato sauce. It was really good, that, actually. And finally, we crimped the pie with some egg wash and semolina, which I recommend for all pies because it just gives it a great crunch. Moment of truth. So we got to the pie, and it is a hefter of a thing when I opened it. And it's almost slightly doughy in the middle. For me, it was just a bit raw, but it needed another 10 minutes and it would have been amazing. Uh, I still ate the damn thing because it was good and it had like pockets of cheese in there and ham and it was fit. Anyway, that was pizza pie done. We tried it and this has been pie it. Have you got any ideas? Because I have run out now. Um, send us a message and you never know. Anyway, have a good one.